This is the sixth annual hymn sing at the barn. Uh, each year in the fall, we make use of a barbecue and an outdoor event, and we bring an indelible grace to have an evening of hymns with students, with the community, with anyone in the area that wants to come and experience an evening of worship outside with RUF. I love Indelible Grace's music. I was talking to one of my friends earlier today on the ride back from church about how I had grown up under all of these historic hymns uh, in an ARP church and never really knew how to appreciate it. But then coming to RUF in the barn and just being able to hear them sung in tunes that were a little bit more my speed and being able to really grow to appreciate the lyrics. Now I sit in church on Sunday with you know the, the piano and the pipe organ and get to just hear the truths of scripture. The hymns we sing, in particular, mean so much to me. Uh, you know, they connect us to the church's truths. Um, these songs have been sung by our, you know, church members for centuries, and now we're taking part in that. Yeah. So tonight we're here for uh, a hymn sing for Indelible Grace and uh, at Erskine. And um, what we do is we take old hymns and we set them to new music. And tonight we're just going to sing the gospel out loud, which is so beautifully expressed in the, in the lyrics of these songs. And so it's a real joy to be here and get get to share this music with folks. You know that the hymns are connecting with students. When the night after RUF, or the night of RUF, or the week after RUF, they're posting lyrics from the hymns on Facebook, and they're quoting those hymns in reference to their own life. I would say RUF at Erskine is a community that reaches students um, to, to give them the gospel of Jesus Christ, to build them up in their faith, and also equips them to reach other students to do the same. RUF at Erskine is, is unique uh, in that for the longest time it was just the barn without the RUF affiliation. And now it has that affiliation which is great, but we do things a little bit differently here in Due West in that at most RUFs, and I've, I've been to several, you don't have a place where you can come out and throw the frisbee. You don't have a place where you can come out and play football. You're not usually going to the campus minister's house and being treated to a free meal outside of the cafeteria once a week. And so that's just been a really great addition that adds so much time for fellowship and also for service because Paul Patrick can't do all of that himself and so the students come out and get to help set up the tables and cook the food. And it's a great time where you can learn to serve and really appreciate the community you're in. Yeah, there's a song we're going to do um, called Let Us Love and Sing and Wonder, which the fourth verse has the, the lyric, Let us wonder grace and justice, join and point to mercy's store when through grace in Christ our trust is justice smiles and asks no more. And for me, that's such a beautiful image to meditate on as you, as you sing it. Um, I love singing that song, and, and, and that's always a special song to sing in a group like this. Every week we announce to the campus uh, through written announcements, verbal announcements, electronic announcements that everyone at Erskine, uh, all students, are welcome and invited to come and participate in the life of RUF. Come out, have barbecue, have Bible study, throw the frisbee, enjoy time together and experience Christian community at Erskine.